Hey everybody! In this video, you are going to meet two of our system members who are classified as internal self-helpers. An internal self-helper is a system member who helps to take care of the system and keep everything well balanced, and usually they are an individual who does not themselves carry trauma, though not always. So let's get started. Hello everyone, my name is Seth, and I am an internal self-helper in our system. Specifically, I am considered our system's conscience. I help make sure that we are all making good, sound moral decisions, regardless of the religious beliefs of the particular system member that we're talking about and I help make sure that everyone gets along and can work through any sort of conflicts they're having in a safe and healthy way. And now a little bit about me. I am 19 years old. Inside, I look blonde with blue eyes. I tend to wear more formal attire. I am very conscientious of the needs of others, and I am well versed in a various number of religious topics. I enjoy helping everyone, and I am not out very often, so this is an interesting experience for me. And I am glad to meet all of you, and I hope you enjoyed meeting me as well. Hello there, y'all. My name is Riley, and I am a caretaker in our system. So, y'all, I'm going to explain a little bit about what I look like inside our system. Inside our system, I have black hair, comes about to my chin. I wear yellow quite frequently, as it is my favorite color. My eyes themselves, in fact, are yellow. And I enjoy flowers, so many of my dresses have flowers on them. I also enjoy a nice hat. And I also have a tendency to wear gloves, because I feel that they are more dainty and ladylike. I often serve sweet tea and peach cobbler on our porch and talk with the others in our system to help them work through their problems. I help to care for everyone and make sure that they have everything they need. I am 32 years old and I am southern, specifically from Georgia. And I am the oldest member of our system at 32. I myself do not have any trauma memories. In fact, I have many of my own memories of a childhood and life completely separate from that that our body had. I grew up inside in a small Georgia town with a school teacher mother and a coal miner father. I had siblings, two of them to be exact. And I grew up during the 1950s. I know now that these memories were an inside life, but I'm still quite attached to them and they still feel very much like my own. But regardless of what my memories may be, I care for everyone in here. I cook, I clean, I help them with their troubles and their arguments. I mediate any sort of uh, discord in our system. And I help to make sure that everyone feels safe and loved and cared for. And it was very nice meeting y'all. And I hope to see y'all again. Well, everybody, I really hope you enjoyed meeting our internal self-helpers, Seth 
and Riley and learning a little bit about them and a little bit about the way that they do things in our system. They are very important system members for us because they help us quite a lot to keep everything peaceful and harmonious inside and help us to make good choices and make everybody feel safe and cared about. So not all systems have internal self-helpers, but for us, our internal self-helpers are very, very important. And I really hope that you enjoyed meeting them, and I hope that you enjoyed this video. Please comment down below any thoughts you have on Seth and Riley and anything you'd like to say to them or ask them. And if you have any other questions or comments, feel free to comment below as well. Don't forget to hit that like button, hit subscribe, and that notification bell. Have a good day, everybody.